तो इनके घर से हम औरतों के बेट में जो बच्चा है कोक में से निकाल के मारेंगे तो इन स्वरों की करो विदाई Well, this is an interesting story right here, further showing that Hinduism and Islam are two sides of the same Luciferian bloodthirsty coin. And that really, when you get down to the facts of the matter, Hinduism, Hinduism and Islam are not any different from each other. Hinduism and Islam are both equally as barbaric and violent. Okay? And this is just one example on a page called a Hindutva Watch, where they just have so many clips. I mean, that's actually where I get all my clips from. And this is just one example. I mean, this stuff is constant. It's not just kind of one, you know, one rare occasion. This stuff is constantly coming out of these Hindus over in India. And this is one example. In this case, you have a Hindu extremist singer. Well, extremists, because, you know, again, the Hindu extremists are not extremists. They're just Hindus. Just like the Muslim extremists are not really extremists. They're just Muslims. They're just being true to their demonic, uh, false, holy, you know, false, unholy book called the Quran. But this Hindu uh, singer is literally openly calling for Hindus to pick up weapons and fight uh, for the Hindu nation. You know, essentially calling for a Hindu jihad. No different than what you'd see Muslims saying, you know, pick up guns and fight for the cause of Allah, you know, fight against the unbelievers. It's no different because, like I said, it's it's just two sides of the same Luciferian coin. So check out, check the clip out. You, you can see it for yourself. अपने कोरोना में थाली बजाया कि नहीं बजाया, दिया जलाया कि नहीं जलाया, जलाया। अब की बार मोदी जी ने कहा अपने घर पे तिरंगा लगाओ, लगाया कि नहीं लगाया। इसका मतलब ये है कि आपके प्रधानमंत्री अगर बिना लॉजिक के आपसे थाली बजवा सकते हैं। आपसे चिराग जलवा सकते हैं प्रधानमंत्री जी अपने लोगों को परख रहे हैं कि अगर कल को इस देश को जरूरत पड़ जाए और अपने सनातनी भाइयों से मैं बोल दूं कि अब हथियार उठाओ तो कौन-कौन तैयार है इसीलिए इटवा के लोगों नारियल पानी कभी पिए हो वो जो काटने वाला आता है अपने घर में लेके रख लो महिलाओं से निवेदन है कि अपने चिमटे पे भी धार लगा के रखें हो सकता है मोदी जी किसी भी समय आके ये कहें कि मैं भारत को हिंदू राष्ट्र घोषित कर रहा हूं और ये है यही आवाज चाहिए मैं भारत को हिंदू राष्ट्र घोषित करना चाहता हूं और अपने सनातनी भाइयों से चाहता हूं कि अगर कहीं कोई दंगा करता आतंकवादी पत्थरबाजी करता हुआ दिखे तो अपने घर से वही हथियार लेके निकलिए तैयार है सब लोग या and this is exactly why I'm an equal an equal opportunist when it comes to Hinduism uh, versus Islam because you know you have some people in particularly what's called the counter jihad movement to where like pretty much anyone that's against Islam they'll align with which they they basically have this mentality of the enemy of my enemy is my friend which you know I don't I don't really agree with that because you know, if we're going to be against Islam because Islam promotes terrorism, then we help. We, we, you know, if we're going to be consistent with that, then we also have to be against Hinduism because just look through the Hindu, you know, the Rig Vita or the Bhagavad Gita, Bhagavad Gita, however you say it, it just it's filled with all kinds of verses talking about killing non-Hindus and you know punishing those who blaspheme Hindu gods and everything else. Yeah, Hinduism is every bit as you know warmongering and violent as Islam. And it's not just with, with uh, I used to say that, you know, Hindu terrorism is limited to India. No, it's spreading out. You know, there is an instance here in Canada. There have been, there have been cases here in Canada where there's one guy, a, a Hindu activist who openly got on TV and called for, you know, essentially a Hindu theocracy and, and killing, you know, non-Hindus. There's like this riot over in, in uh, Leicester, UK, where there's these, this mob of Hindus going around rioting. There's one, there's an instance over in Australia where this Hindu guy was, uh, this Hindu nationalist guy was like attacking Sikhs or whatever else. There's even an instance over in California uh, in America, where there was like this rally against Hindu extremism, and it, it came under like assault from this the 
this gang of Hindus. So it, it's not just within India, it's spreading all over the place because they're just being true to their Hindu texts. So further evidence showing that not only is Hinduism, you know, ne not any less violent or barbaric than Islam, but that, you know, the Hindu terrorists are not terrorists, they're just Hindus. Just like the Muslim terrorists are not terrorists, they're just Muslims. You know, and if you don't like that, well, that's not my problem because facts don't care about your feelings. There's a fact there. There's a clip for yourself. His words, not mine. So anyway, don't be deceived. But in the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, be with all the brethren. Goodbye.